FNAF 2 was confirmed to be a prequel already, but what I want to do is show proof and evidence that it is when the timeline comes out, so you'll know why it is. So first, let's talk about the Bite of 87. No, no, not that one. The other one. There we go. Okay, so I'm confident that it was Mangle who did it. Because the unhinged jaw is the only one that could fit the frontal lobe. And Mangle's jump scare comes from the roof and bites you in the head. Or face. And the wizards, they do look like the OG animatronics, but l the design looks different. Wizard's Chica's jaw is one that probably moves up and down with bars. But if you look on FNAF 1 Chica's jaw, her jaw is hinged, not moving up and down like Wither Chica's. And Foxy, his design is just way different from the other one. Same with the other two. Also, I have proof that it was Jeremy Fitzgerald who is the bite of 87 victim. Because in the FNAF 2 Night 6 phone call, you hear it say this. Uh. We have one more event scheduled for tomorrow, a birthday. You'll be on day shift. Wear your uniform. Stay close to the animatronics and make sure they don't hurt anyone, okay? And if you're wondering why they bit him, is because the purple guy, or William Afton, wears a uniform that a security guard would wear when he kills a children, or something similar to that. And that's why I think that Jeremy Fitzgerald, since he's wearing that outfit, they think that he's the murderer, so they freak out and Mangle bites him. And that's the bite of 87, different from the bite of 83. We'll talk about that in another video. Also, about the withered animatronics, they come way before FNAF 1 and 2. Here's why. They come from the first ever restaurant that gets shut down due to murder, William Afton. And they get sent to the new location at the pizza where the toys are. And that's who the Withers are, not the FNAF 1 animatronics, but from a different pizzeria before the toys. And that explains why they look so different. If you want to know where the FNAF 1 game and animatronics fit in this, it's stated in FNAF 2 that they would reopen a smaller establishment that most likely used the FNAF 1 animatronics in the new reopened smaller establishment. So I know that was a little bit shorter one, mostly because of all the stuff I have to talk about... Um, there was a lot, like, there, there is proof, and it's good proof. You know, there's just not a lot of proof. I would have talked about Balloon Boy 2, except he One, seems two, kind three, of, he, he's strange. I don't know where he fits in this. So I guess that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!